Holy mother of Mac, the new iMac is upgradable. While we were only expecting this round of updates to be processor upgrades, it turns out the 21.5 inch 4K iMac had some surprises for us. Getting into this new iMac was a familiar and sticky process. We used our iMac pizza cutter, I mean opening tool, to cut away the adhesive, lift the display, and disconnect it from the logic board. It's time to compare and contrast. This new iMac has a slightly larger logic board than the last version we saw, making the right speaker a bit smaller. But even more noticeable is a conspicuous heatsink mounting plate right in the middle of the board. But we'll get to that in a minute. Since the speaker was trapped by the logic board, we had to remove the power supply, hard drive, and the fan just to get to the good stuff. But now let's talk about the most interesting part of this iMac. Removing the logic board reveals something we haven't seen in years, removable RAM. A huge win for upgradability. But the surprises weren't over. Remember that heatsink we saw earlier? Someone didn't want us to see what lies beneath. But whatever, we ripped off that warranty void sticker like a Band-Aid and it felt so good. What did we find? A modular CPU. That's right, this three gigahertz quad core Intel Core i5-7400 processor can be lifted right off its standard LGA-1151 CPU socket. Please don't make me say that again. And the other less modular chips on the board include the AMD Radeon Pro 555 GPU and the two gigabytes of SK Hynix VRAM. If you're looking for it, we've got the complete list of chips we've identified over on our site. With the iMac fully disassembled, it was time to evaluate its repairability. The 2017 21.5 inch 4K iMac scored a three out of 10, and here's why. On the upside, the CPU and RAM, two of the components you're most likely to upgrade at some point, are both modular. The standard 2.5 inch SATA hard drive is fully upgradable, though you can't add a blade SSD thanks to an empty pad on the logic board. Cutting the tape to open the iMac isn't too hard with the right tools, but it must then be replaced to complete any repair. But on the downside, the glass and the retina display are fused together, increasing the cost of replacement. And most replaceable components like the RAM are buried behind the logic board, meaning you'll have to take apart most of the iMac just to gain access to them. But we believe in you, you can do it. We're so excited to help you upgrade your iMac that we're doing parts compatibility testing as we speak. So stay tuned to find out just how upgradable it actually is. That's all for this teardown. Don't forget to check out the full teardown over at ifixit.com and stay tuned for more teardowns coming this week. See you next time.